Okay, taking the first derivative of the moment generating function and evaluating it at t equals zero, we get e to the mu t plus sigma squared t squared over two times, now we need to take the derivative of the exponent with respect to t. The derivative of mu t with respect to t is mu plus and the derivative of the second term there is sigma squared over 2 is a constant times the derivative t squared is 2t. Okay, and now we need to evaluate that whole function at t equals 0. Okay, putting a 0 into the first term we get e to the 0 plus 0 is e to the 0, which is of course just 1 times, and then we get mu plus uh, putting in a zero for the t, you get zero. So our first derivative with, res uh, with respect to t, evaluating at t equals zero, we get the mean mu, which is exactly what we were hoping to get.